Go ahead. Hi, my name is Alvin Reed, and this is how uh, God brought me from death to life. March of 2020, I had to go into the hospital for a surgery. I had a medical condition where I, I, my esophagus didn't work correctly. I'd fought it my whole life. And by the beginning of 2020, my esophagus didn't work correctly inside of me and developed sores, lesions. And so in March of 2020, I went in to have the surgery done and they removed my esophagus. And uh, as I came out of that surgery, everything seemed fine, but uh, it all went wrong. I developed a fistula. I leaked into my body. My body became septic. I developed double pneumonia. Uh, my kidneys stopped working. Uh, during subsequent surgeries where they tried to fix me, they tore my pancreas. So I became malnutritioned. I was in a coma for two weeks, ICU for two months, and I was in a hospital total for, for five months. During the two weeks I was in a coma and I was in the ICU, my mind was everywhere. I was completely delusional due to medications they were giving me. They were supposed to write it, but it pushed me in the wrong way. I thought my wife had left me. I thought my kids didn't like me. I thought there was nothing left. When I came out of that, uh, they had called my wife, the doctor did, and said, we took everything down, we left them open to keep them cleaned out. And uh, there's nothing left we can do, it's all up to God now. And my wife, who is my advocate and my angel, made for me, hit her knees and prayed. <sighs> Sorry. She, uh, she would call the hospital and ask them to put the phone by my head so she could listen to me breathe because uh, she, she wasn't allowed to visit because the pandemic had started. I know that her prayers, her advocacy for me with God is what is what he came into my spirit and kept me going. When I entered the hospital, I was five foot nine inches tall and 210 pounds. And when I came out, I was five seven and 126 pounds. Uh, it's been two years since then. I had to go on opioids for a couple of years Coming off those opioids, I misused alcohol. I really started to abuse it. I went to rehab to get cleared up off of that. And that's, that's when my eyes were open. I started going to meetings. They talked about a higher power. And the only higher power I know was God. And I asked him to be my sponsor. And I haven't looked back. Uh, I, I, I am a grateful believer. And I know I struggle with things on this earth, but with him by my side and asking him to come into my life, uh, every day is glorious. I wake up every day and I pray the prayer my wife used to do that's, you know, thank you for this day. Thank you for there in my lungs, the blood in my veins. And please guide me and take me to where you need me. And he is so great and awesome. And I am so thankful.